skill, flair, color, and passion. All hallmarks of Brazilian football, the nation admired around the globe as guardians of the beautiful game. But every tale has a beginning. This is Charles Miller's story, the father of Brazilian football. Born into Sao Paulo's British expat community in November 1874, Miller was sent 6,000 miles across the sea to Southampton, an English port city better known today for its cruise ships and containers. A natural sportsman good at both cricket and football, the young Miller, nicknamed Nipper, began attracting attention, playing for both the county team and local side St Mary's, the forerunner of Premier League team Southampton. Ten years after his arrival as a boy, it was time for Miller the man to return home to Brazil, little knowing he was about to become one of Southampton's greatest ever exports. Sailing into the port of Santos in 1894, aboard the Royal Mail ship Magdalena, his luggage was a legend in the making. Whatever the truth of his arrival, the Sao Paulo Athletic Club became Miller's natural home, where cricket and tennis were already being played among the British expat elite. Brazil's first ever organized football match was not far behind, with Miller a cut above his colleagues. Miller's key role in football history largely faded until his death in 1953, five years before Brazil's first World Cup victory. A plaza outside Corinthians' Parcambu Stadium now bears his name, as Miller's grandson recalls. Brazil have come a long way since Miller first stepped off the boat in Santos, but his footballing legacy lives on. <laughs>